Hi, my name is John Mark Carlson. I'm the fabrication shop foreman here at Shin Mechanical. Recently we had a project at the SR99 tunnel. We had a large main that ran at the bottom of the tunnel that had odd angle, what we would call lateral saddles off the pipe. And we had quite a few drains that needed to tie into those saddles. But the problem that we had was how were we gonna efficiently do a layout for each one when there was 350 of them and they're all at odd angles. The tunnel was miles long and you had guys in there walking six to eight miles a day. If they don't fit, then they're walking even more than that. We tried to use a tremble tool to shoot in points from one location to the other for tie-ins. We realized that that took approximately three to three and a half hours just for the detailer to make a drawing with all those given scenarios and he was having a hard time getting those points to line up. I was tasked by Mr. Shin to come up with a good way to do the layout. I came up with a way to make a swivel joint that allows us to get our angle as well as our dimension. It pivots on one point and it can pivot all the way down to 60 degrees. We actually cut these pieces with our water jet here at Shin. They're a tight fit to each other so there's no play. We greased them when we put them together and they just slip, simply are two plates sliding on each other but it allows us to have a set point at our from here to center and from here to center on the jig. And then we also made several different adjustable lengths so that we could go longer, shorter, for all the different tie-ins out there. Once we get it set, we tied in to our tie-in point and our main, set this joint with a jam nut, set these jam nuts, and it allows us to pull it out, set it on our jig in the tunnel, and we can measure. We burn four inches here to our end and get a dimension there. Do the same thing on this side, burn four inches to the end and get a dimension. Put a protractor on it. We get our degree. Once we have those three things, then we have everything we need to be able to build this part. One thing it also did is allow anybody to do the layout. Sometimes you need to have a special guy that knows the math and is really good with layout to do something. Any journeyman could do this. We could have an apprentice do this. That also played a part in allowing us to continually do layout without having to worry about who was doing it. We knew we were getting an accurate dimension. Now that we have our cut length, all that we had to do is cut the pipe, vick it, bevel it, put it together. We could, from the time I got this drawing, we could build it in a day, get it on a truck to the galvanizer. We could get a one day turnaround on a piece that typically take three or four days to get. We could do this in a day, get it to the galvanizer, pick it up the next morning and have it on site the next day. Okay, and it's bad.
getting the quick turnaround, eliminating that three and a half to three hour layout time saved us hundreds upon hundreds of man hours and therefore allowed the job to be successful. That's the house roll.